Game Guru. Hello world, what is up? I am the Game Guru and welcome back to the park. This is episode 4. We are in Lorraine's house. We have found out that her life is crumbling and falling apart. And we're at the exit. And bad things are happening. Oh, there's a notice here. Dunwich Emergency Services. Patient name Mallard. Lorraine Kimberly. Date of committal. That date. Date of discharge. That date. Diagnosis depression. Lorraine seems to be suffering from depression that began early in her pregnancy. Our discussions have made it obvious that these episodes stem from the grief of losing her partner, Don, who died about six months ago. There are also several unresolved issues with her father. After being kept under careful observation, we provided standard treatment for this disorder, including electroconvulsion therapy. The patient was res the patient responded and made a rapid recovery. Aftercare recommendations are weekly follow-up with the lo local physician. Oh, excuse me. Mood stabilization, lithium-based. Discharge instructions. Lorraine has a newborn son, Callum, who was placed in foster care shortly after birth when Lorraine displayed symptoms of disorientation and depression. It is our judgment that Lorraine is fit to have her son return to her as long as she follows her recommended aftercare routine and continues with her medication. We have faith that she will be given will be an effective caregiver. Lorraine has her own housing and her employer, Susie, has said that she is welcome to return to her shifts at the diner. Norma Creed, a local woman, has offered to care for Callum while Lorraine works. It is with this support network in mind that we feel confident releasing Lorraine from this institution. Medication instructions. A prescription for Zolift can be filled at Flags Pharmacy in Kingsmouth. She has been advised to start with a 50 mg dose and then, based on the advice of her doctor, to increase the medication as needed. Wow. There's a lot of reading in this game. Not nearly as much as pathologic, but... Still, I wasn't expecting it. I was just expecting to be scared. Scared all the time. Back into the basement. More basement. Open the door, nothing. Oh. Quack, quack. And then the duck came back. What about ducks? I'm scared of chipmunks. I've got nothing against ducks. Nightmare Circus. Bane comb. Oh man, these angles keep getting harder. The park, it was a wait, wait, waiting on a child for a take, take, take and use and joy for bait, bait, baiting while her mother's mind is breaking. Analgia is a win. Uh, analgia is a whatever. Mm, medication. Flags Pharmacy, Lorraine Mallory, take two tablets by mouth. In the morning, it hold your gorses, Lorraine. I need to read this. Then one tablet whenever you have an episode. Thank you. Cigarettes, self-medicating. Read letter. Lorraine, things aren't right between us at the moment. I know. I want to try and explain it. I think it is because I'm so far from home and I'm working so hard. Every day working at the park, it gets worse, like a spring inside my mind, winding tighter and tighter and tighter. When we go for drinks after work, it gets a little bit better. The guys relax and we laugh and we're, we're good people again. I don't want to come home to you without being in my right mind. But when this job is done, we need to get out of this place. We need to go back to the city where I don't feel like this anymore. I love you, Donald. P.S. I was thinking about names for boys and girls. I like Callum for a boy and Emma if it's a girl. Aw, she took his name. More disconnect notices. We've already read that. Hey. This looks... Aw, oh, man. Am I on a loop? Oh, I think I'm supposed to be afraid of the loop. Wait a sec. Uh, hello, little boy. I'm just gonna look at your baseball cap. Yep, still a baseball cap. Callum. Hey. How you doing, little guy? Come on, man. Whoa, this is different. Milk, cheese, bread, butter, corn, potatoes, apple. It's still the same thing. Remember, take the pills. Follow up with Dr. Spencer. Organize babysitter for Callum. Faucet's still not fixed. Wrench is gone. All right. Let's do the loop again. Okay. What's with this new duck theme? Are you hiding behind the TV, little boy? Quack, quack, quack. 
What a lovely performance. Don't you just love it when child children put on that... Whoa! Thank you, William, for the new watch. It is very nice. It has made me a uh, happy... A happy carrot. It's made me a happy carrot. I'm always happy to be a happy carrot. And then I spilled a little bit of coffee on this. That's my bad. So, you, know, you know how you can get when you're drinking coffee and then you get jittery? Oh, yeah. I don't really know. I don't drink very much coffee. Nothing? Nothing yet? Nope. This guy and his duck. Oh, hello. How's it going? Oh, I just couldn't find my medicine, you know? I just needed some more medicine. This is the Nightmare Circus. We know about that. It's all good. Ah, uh, this note's gone. Teddy bear's there. Hunger. A shocking true story. Have we marked it up yet or anything? No. Oh, this poor kid, man. Hey, Gallum! You need to clean your room! And stop getting blood in your cap! And, and, uh... Why her... Yeah, her lie. See her try. See her cry. Bye bye, um, me. I. What? She. she I don't. That. I don't care. Callum! Need to clean your room. Oh, yeah, as my milligrams. 100 milligram tablets. Oh, that's too much effort to find out if my medicine's increasing. Hey! Did you fix a faucet yet? Feel like that wrench is gonna come back to haunt me. Door's still locked. Pizza? Any chicken? Oh, nope, just alcoholism. Just alcoholism. Callum! Hey! Nope, still not open. Okay, where's the dead kid? Come on. Something about ducks? Oh yeah, this isn't har horrifying at all. Every trip I make through this house gets a little more. Oh, the door's not even. Door's not even closed. It makes me think that this door. Nope. The mother duck and his quacking. Dude, cut it out with your duck stuff. Okay, yeah. That, that, then we just decided to decorate the house a little. You know it needed a, a little mood lighting, a little paint job, you know? Definitely, it definitely needed more naked dolls um, everywhere. Just straight up everywhere. Here we go. The Willing. Oh, okay. With Can You Hear Us, Lorraine? One of the most important science fiction writers of a generation, The Willing. A sun will struck the earth. Millions of cattle are uprooted from their homes. A young shadow searches desperately for a way to cleave, to stop global domination. And an exotic dancer, listen, Lorraine, is the key to saving the world again. Dynamic, exciting, irrepressible, anything I'll come to expect. Answer us, Lorraine, novel. Lorraine, we are watching. You'd better believe that she is bigger, better, and bolder than ever. All right, so I'm in a coma. I'm definitely in a coma. And these things are my two best friends, Dawn and Laura. Laura. Alright, one thing I wanted to check. Hold on. How do I... The book's now upside down. Can you hear us, Lorraine? The willing a sun will cattle shadow... No, it doesn't make sense. I was hoping maybe the, all the caps help. Alright. We gotta get out of the coma. Dismembered head. I never said it had to be human. There's the, the baby bottle head, or pill bottle head. All right, oh, wait, back here. Shopping list, Zolift prescription, Zolift prescription. Yep, lots of Zolift prescription. Callum is no longer who he once was. You are alone, nobody loves you. Oh, did Callum leave? Did he grow up? Did I, hello? Hello? Ice pick, 
I don't want an ice pick. Uh, did I self lobotomize myself? I don't want to go in here. All right, so okay. All right, okay. All right. Nope. There's nothing like being trapped in a dark room. This is a metaphor for uh, not being able to wake up from the dream. Oh, okay. Hello? Hello? Example drawing. I love you from Callum. Well, I decided I don't like Callum much anymore. Door! Hey! Come on, man. Cut it out. I gotta get that fixed. Read letter. Received your letter and quite surprised. Oh, blah, blah. I didn't run away. Dad took me. Yeah, Mom. Don't you know? This isn't spooky, the blue fog at all. Oh, what's this letter? Oh, okay, Miss Malliard, as we agreed in our meeting today, we considered you to be batshit fucking insane. Let's be clear, you are in no way sound of mind and body, and you are a danger to everybody around you. Please note that your only escape from this should be drugs, a shitload of them. Smoking, snorting, oral, intravenous, take them any way you can, and as often as you can. Take that shit, o taking that, that shit can only make your life better. In case there was any doubt, you are suffering a relapse, and nobody really cares. Nobody can help you now. Don't fuck this up. Dr. Spock, Dunwich Medica. Yeah, so, definitely, I'm definitely ODing slash self lobotomizing slash wrist slitting scribble 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 and then the man the the ghost man thing that the ghouly guy that's coming and talking about ducks the, the, i'm gonna call him duck guy since he uses this weird obsession with ducks hey no not yet we'll get there don't worry round six this is called the episode of walk around the house Lorraine, Lorraine, I need you to focus on what we are discussing. The chipmunk killer, Steve Gardner, he was locked away for what he did to those kids. Nathaniel Winter hasn't been seen in years, but he is nowhere near the Atlantic Island Park. We've established this. You know this. I know this. Oh, that music. It's driving me. Those pictures. Medicine. Everything. The hunger. A shocking true story. The story. The woodcutter is dead. The witch always wins. 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 And all of these in here, all these pages, this broken story, whatever. Dun 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 dun. Fighting. Oh, bloody dripping walls. It's not getting creepy. Hello. This picture of me. My two best friends, the shining music, it's not getting to my nerves at all. We are talking, can you hear us Lorraine? The killing, a son will be devoured, all the cattle will be enslaved, the shadow lies on your future, our domination. If you listen Lorraine, you are the key to damning the womb. We are irresponsible, you can only join us Lorraine. Lorraine, we are one. Who's we? Who's we? Are these ghosts? Maybe they're ghosts? Oh, dripping ceiling blood. Ah, I've always wanted a little dripping ceiling blood. Read the shopping list. Oh, what am I getting? I'm getting Zola Perceptions. Forget Don. Forget Dad. Can not him. Oh, okay. Yep, we're cooking the baby now. I feel like this this faucet's only getting worse. And okay. Yep. Yeah. The babies may have continued to get more real life. Open door. Nothing. Bleeding. Bleeding doors. Hanging bodies. That's not creepy at all. Oh yeah. Hey, bear. Nothing against you or anything personal, but we just needed to, uh, to, I needed that button to fix my pants, and that's my bad. I, I don't know why I put them in the fridge, though. The door's, no, I'm not, I can't open the door. Okay, definitely. Hello? Lorraine? Lorraine, wait, we need you to wake up. Read the letter. I didn't run away, Dad took me. I know. Water damage. Ceiling blood. Ceiling chains. This is also horrible. 
Let's read this notice again. Um, now he's super scribbled out. All right, take two, maybe. Back into the basement. Oh, music change. You gonna talk about some more ducks, dude? Ducks? That's not good. I don't like it when the guy stops talking about ducks. Uh-oh. This is different. Things are different. And I'm afraid of Stories different. Stories are told again and again. And from their shape we build our understanding of the world. Two children are led into the woods. They are lost for a time, but then are captured by an old witch. The child goes missing in Atlantic Island Park. He wanders lost for a time before finding his way into the mouth of an old witch. In the oldest version of this story, the mother and the witch were the same person. I never wanted to be the witch, but I am, aren't I? Most likely. Pretty sure you done straight up killed Callum. Now you're OD. Kids broke in today. It's been so long since I heard laughter. So very long. I took one of them. I couldn't help myself. It was fast. The others didn't notice. I liked hearing him laugh. This boy was from the academy. I put him on a slab. I tickled him until he couldn't breathe. My machines came to life, whirring in time to his gasps and shrieks. I think this is delightful. The change wrought in me by the machines is not yet complete. There must be other children I can lay on my slab. Okay. Is that me or the doctor dude? Or am I the doctor dude? And that's just a dude. I'm, I'm gonna stop hypothesizing, man. This is getting insane. Eyes without sparkle. Eyes without sparkle. QBL publishing. Okay. Not creepy music at all from the olden times. Hello? Can I run yet? No. Read the book. Examine the book. Hansel and Gretel. Hansel and Gretel. Hansel and Gretel. Brothers Grimm. What's that? Hello? Oh! Turns out when you read a Hansel and Gretel, you open secret passages. Into boiler rooms. Hello? Calum. Calum! Come on, girl. You can make it. Let's do this. Oh, no. Calum. It's on the slab. It's on the slab. Calum. What is the meaning of this? What is it? I want to know. Calum. I want answers. No. Chip. Or Chad. Or whatever. Why? Why did you do this to my baby? Hello? The ice pick! A witch finger. Don't do it, lady. Resist. Resist. Oh no! The witch and one are the same. What? So she definitely did it. That is so sad. Is that it? Nope. Hey, Lorraine. Lorraine. Don't blame yourself, Lorraine. People lose things all the time. It's just the guy from the... Yeah, that's the, the dude from the initial office. Take a deep breath and think about the last place you saw your son. The last place I saw him was on the table when I was murdering him. In my heart and mind, I always return to Atlantic Island Park. Definitely insane. Dreamlike state. 
Why the chipmunk? Alright! Kinda interesting ending, I guess. I feel like there is a lot more that I may have missed. There seem to be so many themes throughout it that I really wanted them to come together more coherently. But otherwise, it's a pretty good game. There was definitely that that chip scare at the Cotton Candy Shack. Oh, that got me. That got me good. There were definitely a couple others that, that got me. I, I, I really enjoyed the... I guess a lot of horror games I've played recently are kind of like Amnesia or those types of games where there is the, the thought of the fear of death or Outlast recently and there's the possibility for you to die in the game but when you die in the game you just go back a little bit and so that really defeats the purpose of being afraid because you're like well if the bad guy gets me I just lose a couple minutes of my time but in this game there was no death you just had to push forward all the time and it was just haunting and horrifying and it turns out chasing a kid through a theme park an abandoned theme park is not enjoyable <laughs> all right it looks like this is going to be the end of the episode i am the game Gru, and this was the park thank you so much for watching so that's going to be it I don't know what the next video is going to be yet. I haven't thought that far ahead. I actually recorded this entire series in one sitting. Really get the juices flowing, you know? <sighs> and it's definitely gone to me. So, I guess I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. This is the Game Guru signing off. Have a good one.